Hey Tiger fans, this is Asia Harrison back with another Tiger Report. I hope you enjoyed homecoming week. We had a lot of big wins, so let's dive in. On Saturday, the Texas Southern football team picked up their first win of the season as they dominated from start to finish and celebrated homecoming in style and route to a 52-7 win over Lincoln University. DeCorey Howard rushed in three touchdowns and had 94 yards on 10 attempts. Ladarius Owens rushed for 139 yards on 13 carries and found the end zone as well. Jace Wilson passed for 130 yards on 14 of 23 passing, while defensive back Kanari Simmons had six stops, followed by two and a half sacks by linebacker Jacob Williams. The soccer team had a phenomenal weekend as they swept their SWAC opponents Alcorn State 4-2 on Friday and Mississippi Valley 5-0 on Sunday. Against Alcorn, Isabella Dillo, Lillian Bays, and Hajar Ben Oud scored. Against Mississippi Valley, Isabella Dillo and Ibukan Lawson scored two goals apiece. The fifth goal came from senior Victoria Pucci as Sunday was also senior day. Pucci was honored in a pre-match ceremony in what would be her final match inside Durley Stadium. The goal was also her first of the season, by the way. The volleyball team faced three SWAC opponents last week as they swept Arkansas Pine Bluff on Monday in three sets. Amber Johnson and Gracie Hill led the way for the Tigers with 10 kills each. Dallas Ballonet Flores had 19 assists and 12 kills in the victory as well. On Tuesday, TSU fell to Grambling State 3-1, while on Sunday, the team battled it out in five sets against Southern, but wasn't able to pull through, falling 3-2. The men's golf team opened the 2023-2024 season as they concluded the Thomas W. Dorch Jr. HBCU Golf Classic in Georgia and finished in sixth place. Liam O'Rourke was a top scorer for the Tigers, breaking into the top 10. The women's golf team also opened its season as they finished in 10th place at the Bearcat Invitational in Huntsville, Texas. Ashley Hobbs was a top scorer for TSU with her two-day finish of 159. Olivia Brown was named the SWAC Women's Cross Country Runner of the Week for her outstanding performance at the McNeese Cowboy Stampede on September 23rd. Brown finished 18th overall in the 5K, coming in at 19.51. The men's cross country team returned to action this past weekend at the Chili Pepper Festival in Fayetteville, Arkansas. Jose Gonzalez was the team's top finisher in the 8K race in a time of 26.13, while Jeremiah Barrera ran a time of 27.06. Before we close, fall is in the air, and that means the start of TSU bowling and basketball seasons as bowling travels to Prairie View A&M for an exhibition on Saturday morning, while the TSU men's and women's basketball teams will participate in SWAC Media Day activities in Humble, Texas. The women's media day starts on Tuesday, followed by the men on Wednesday at DNA Studios. To stay up to date, be sure to visit our website at tsusports.com or follow us on Instagram and Twitter at TXSO Tigers.